Could I just say something? Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I didn't want to interrupt while you were trying to read the messages. Um, I've been watching Lisa for a long time, and I've watched her decline so much in probably the last six months, I'm going to say. Mm -hmm. And today, when I was in your live and I was watching her get angry and hang up and then go live like three seconds later, I've never seen her do it that quickly that much. Right. And it just kind of shouts out like how bad she's gotten. And when she lost her child and all of these things and the bruises and, and I was listening to what Tattoo said and he's absolutely right. Speaking of a victim of domestic violence, a lot of women will try to cover their bruises with purple makeup because your bruises are purple. When have we ever seen Lisa put on purple eyeshadow? Mm -hmm. I've never seen her do that. Right. Um, and to know that this is getting this bad, I just, it's almost heartbreaking. When you guys said we weren't going to watch her live anymore, like I really depended on you guys because I was like, that's it. I'm not going on there. But I don't even know what to do to help her. Like, I, it, it's heartbreaking. And the saddest thing is, is until she's ready to do something, it's just heartbreaking that we're all watching her just decline so badly. And I know, like I said, I've been watching her for a long time. I know her family's trying to help. I, I follow Jess. Um, this was the first time I've ever heard Ronnie say anything, but I definitely know they've been trying. And it's just, I appreciate what you guys are doing because I really want to stick to not going on to any of her lives. But it, at the same time, I'm so worried. Like, I just hope that one day I get on and I'm going to see that she's gone and that she's at a rehab center and that she's doing good and she doesn't have access to any kind of phones or electronics or computers or any way she can get online and, and do this anymore. Yeah, we're hoping for that too. It's, but it's, thank so, you guys. Hard. it's so hard to watch. Yeah, it, it's so much. And you guys are like, I love this page. I, when I stumble, I don't even know how I find you, but you stumbled across my For You page one day and I've been watching you guys ever since. And you guys are really trying to do a good deed. And, and that is, I know her family's got to feel thankful because I don't even know these people and I'm thankful that you're doing it. Mm -hmm. Aw, thank you so much. That means a lot. No a problem. Lot I'll hop off because I know there's a million people that want to get on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> thank you. We appreciate that, Jay. Thank you. Enjoy the rest of your day. You too. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I just wanted to make a co further comment about the response here because they're saying that they will send them SIGs through the mail and uh, send a package. I mean, I, I don't recommend that either. I mean, I can't control what anybody does, but uh, right. you you heard what her family said. Nothing of financial value. Right. Nothing of financial value. And that's what we stick with as well. Um. So I would encourage people to not do that. Yeah. Yeah, don't do that. Uh, I just received word uh, that a liaison from the Pittsburgh Police Department is watching this live right now. Good. How about that? That's good. Um, here's a better picture. Oh, somebody said it's a better picture of the eye, but there's nothing attached. Ah! <laughs> I get those a lot too. I'm like, where yeah, did it go? what yeah. happened? Someone, I, I'm, oh, let me see if this is the same person. Oh, this is from, um, I think Brandy was bringing this up. Did you get smokes? No, I need 20 on Cash App. Can you please help? I need to go now. And you can see that's just from like a little over an hour ago. Give me a moment. I know she's messaging a lot of people because a lot of people have reached out to me. So I think, I think, I think it's coming. I think we're going to, I think it's coming to a halt here. Very, 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 very soon. Yeah. Um, someone th thought that they looked like there was a bruise on her collarbone. I'm wondering if they mean like over here, maybe. No, it looks just like her, her blade is... Her, her whole blade and her whole clavicle is just her. It's all pressed in. Her her oculars are pressed in. Like you could just uh, the life is just being drained from her. Yeah. Thank you, Casey. 
But you do get a better look there, kind of at what's going on with her mouth. I'm not sure what what's going on there. That could be, that could be chocolate, for all we know. I mean, and um, you know, for for the eyes. I mean, I don't know. This part to me doesn't look like um, the eyeshadow. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, that looks like she was like 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 hit with like I don't know like something with an object. Not because it's very hard to get a fist right up into that eye there to get a bruise like that. I'm just being honest with you. Like, I mean, it's possible, but if she got hit by a fist in that fashion in her eye, there would be a lot of more damage to her eye than just that bruise in her, you know, in that inner crease of her eye there. There we go. Yeah, it would be more spread out. You know what I mean? Or she would have, oh, uh, she would have had a lot of plot blood vessels in her eyes. Like, yeah. I just don't see that being an actual, I don't see that being like a biscuit hit. You know what I mean? I see that being like, Maybe she was poked with something, or I think I think it's just you or know somebody took their fingers dehydration, of, starvation, or somebody uh, took their finger and pressed it into her face. No sleep. I mean, that could be it too, but yeah, you know what I mean. Different picture. Because she does wear glasses, so it could have been the glasses that hit her. Mm. Does that make sense? Mm-hmm. I mean, she probably got them from, like, America's Best, so they're probably, like, made of, like, solid steel, and they probably weigh, like, a pound, so to break those is almost impossible. You know how them cheap shit, them cheap, uh, the ones you get for free through Medicaid. So, I see that as, I don't see that as, uh, that's the only logical explanation I could see, is, like, maybe <laughs> if they hit her in the face and hit her in the, you know, hit her in the glasses, because, you know, people oh, never gosh. have problems lumping somebody with a, with a pair of glasses on. Oh, but that is definitely a bruise. That is not makeup. And it's like, you could just tell it's pop blood vessels. I don't yeah. know. You, you could start to, you, you could start to see the shape of her cranium now. That is what's scary is you can, she's kind of, you, know, her, you could see her, like her cheekbones are starting to, to, to protrude. Uh, her jaw is starting to sag. Like, look at above her eyes. Her, her just, yeah. her tie. Oh my goodness. That, that is something extremely progressive that has happened to her. Yeah, I was going to say, she's starting to look like um, her, hair, her hairline is receding and she's starting to look a little bit like a skeleton with a wig thrown on top. And I'm saying that out of love and concern, not to be mean. This is why I just, I, I would love for her parents to see this right here. Right. I know her mom, they said her mom saw it, but I just would love to see. I, I feel like if Lisa was half as worried as any one of us are, you know, she would be in treatment right now. Guys, be patient with the boxes. We're going through so much at the moment. We're anticipating some people to come up. So yeah. just be patient. Just be patient with us, guys. There's a lot of, we got 2.2K in here. We're with a hot average right now. So just bear with us, okay? Yeah. We will get to you, though. And we got a ton of people watching us, too. And we got people watching us that uh, are, uh, are from the outside. So yeah. I saw this pop up, too, but I didn't get a screenshot. And I didn't see it because it went by so fast. That girl at your mom's house. Thank you so much, Stephen. Or Stephanie, I'm sorry. Um, they Their comment was SIGs because people were, they were offering to send her SIGs. SIGs is better than ICE. Of course it is. I mean, ice is horrible, but she don't do ice, so. Yeah, she and it's not for cigarettes either. Nice try, wrong guy. Yeah, it's not for cigarettes. And do you yeah. think that if somebody mailed her a carton of cigarettes, do you think that she would keep them all? Exactly. She trade them for rugs. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, she sent Saved by God's Grace a text. Ugh, I'm going through them all. We're going through them. Just make sure you message them to scam. Yeah, she did. In the meantime, um, let me see who I have here. Guys, if you could just hold them off to questions and concerns for now, that would be awesome. Yeah, and not, you know, like um, something that's going to be a, a long story or something like that. And not to discount anybody's stories, but... We're yep. going to have a story time night for that. We're going to have a story time night for Yay, that. Yay, story time. Yeah, yes, and I already have a bu I already have a bunch of stories that people sent to me 
and I will message everybody and let them know when it's going to be. And then people can send me their stories as well. Any new ones. Yes. Uh, I'm going to bring up Heather really quick. Heather. Heather. This is from Saved by God's Grace. Mm. The Jesus Louises. Wow, right? Crazy. Whew, she's bugging. She yeah. is bugging. I mean, she's indeed bugging. No, Jake, I think we're setting up a night to do story time. Well, I don't think we're doing it tonight. I think we're going to no, do it. No, no, not tonight. Because I'm going to have a weekend, like a Saturday night or something, you know, or like a Sunday evening type thing. Aw, thank you. Can you guys thank hear me? All this stuff oh, dies down. Yes. Thank you, Mandarella. I didn't. Can you guys hear me okay? Yes. yes. Okay. Hi. I don't want anything. I just. I just wanted to come tell my best friends, hey, sorry, I've been busy at work. Um, and make sure you guys are all doing well. Yes, we're doing well. Are we well. good? We're trying to be. Holly, you know where we are. Chat to, uh, I, I know. I know. That's why I'm coming to do my mental health check-in with my peoples. Scam, you doing okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm hanging in there. Okay. Well, I Thank was listening you. to you guys all day while I was at work, and I was like, kind of throwing my two cents in when I could. But I've just been really busy. But I just want to tell you guys that I love you, and I'm gonna hop down now because I know you have a ton of people. But I just wanted to yeah, check uh -huh. on my people. Well, thank you. We love you too. Thanks. Thanks. We love you okay, so I'll, much. I'll be in the comments. All right, thank babe. You so much. We appreciate you. Um. So I got a message um from that person. Oh, thank you, Gaga, from um that person who said that they might mail her cigarettes. Ooh. It says, I should probably further explain myself because now seeing that it does look bad, cigarettes I know are illegal to send, but in regards to a package, it would include hygiene, food, water supplies. Other than that, no, I guess I should have worded it better, but I did want to make her feel comfortable enough to contact me. Sorry for the confusion. There's no confusion. We don't encourage you to send a package that includes hygiene, food, water supplies, or any of that either. I mean, I, I, I don't know. There's no confusion on my end. There might be some confusion on your end. We don't, we don't encourage anything a monetary value. I don't. Hygiene products and food and water supplies are worth money. So anything worth money she should not be given right there's if you want to do a, that then that's still enabling right uh i'm gonna give you guys a, a teach you a little bit of lesson it's called asset allocation where she takes assets from one place and she moves it to another place so if somebody is giving her money for one thing she's going to be able to take the money from that that she was going to use for that and apply it to another thing mm -hmm. Asset allocation. Exactly. Yeah, if people are giving her money every day for food, then that allows her to sell the food stamps. Mm -hmm. Right. Or allows her to eat and not have to spend money on food. Right. Send her cigarettes. She don't have to spend the money on cigarettes. Now she can spend it on more rack. But yep. she'll still be on here every day begging for cigarettes six times a day, even if you send her cigarettes. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And now she's got to a point of entitlement that she uh, let it get the best of her. And now she's gotten involved with some people that are now got a stronghold on her. And and here we are. Wednesday mm -hmm. evening. Mm -hmm. June 12th, 2024. Right. Okay. With yeah, Lisa. I don't know if this person was, uh, you know, legit or not. This was the person that said I sent her forty today. Oh, you know, it's not legit. Look at that name. Yeah, that's the one. That's all right. That one. That name's getting put into a separate folder that I have for people just like that. It's a whole separate folder. We love the British Broadcasting Company. Nice. Uh, let's see. <laughs> this is Gaga. <clears throat> You message someone. Yes, Belinda. She's been on all day today. Where's her family? Well, two of her sisters were here, and uh, her father is not with her, like she claimed. You know, waiting outside. He's actually on his way to see 
Lisa's sister in the hospital. And grandbaby. Yeah. Great yeah. grandbaby. Excuse me. Oh, grandbaby. Yeah, grandbaby. Sorry. Is someone else able to read this to give my throat a break? Yeah, I got you. Paul, you want me to read it or you got it? I got it. All right, honey, go ahead. Please don't send money to Lisa. She is not going to rehab. She wants rugs. Please go to Scam Slam 411 on here to find out more. And the person replied, I did check the live out and no thank you. I'm not interested in that. I'm a grown woman who's fully aware of the situation and how I choose to interact with Lisa is my choice. Wow. I respect your decision, but I do not feel the same way. For fuck's sake. Wow. Continues. All right. Uh, and they say, I'm sorry you feel that way. Lisa is taking advantage of kind-hearted people, and those dollars are getting her even closer to the morgue. It is hurting her kids and sister so deeply. I hope you reconsider. And she says, well, I'm assuming it's she, I don't know. She is responsible for herself. Her choices are hers alone. Stop putting that on other people. Stop trying to play God. Wow. Play God? Right? Play God. Wow. What the fuck? Mm-mm. You, thank you. Does God approve of your actions there? Oh, I... You think God wants you to give money to someone who is in this state right now? Of right. Which... You think that that's what God would want you to do? Ugh, for fuck's sake. I can't even believe these people. Like, how do they even reconcile this within themselves? Look, this is Sophia. Oh, Sophia. Sophia! Yeah, somebody so in the we stop, we should stop playing God, but somebody in the comments said they should stop playing the Grim Reaper. Yeah, no shit! Ain't that the truth? <laughs> no shit. Peace and happiness 420. Oh, for fuck's sake. They need wow. more 420 in their life if this is what oh, they're doing. Thank you to everybody who's sending in these messages. I appreciate it. That was from Gaga. Thank you. Good yes, you're, you know what? for fuck's sake. Your communication was perfect. Kudos on that. Yes. Because after the first response, I don't know if I could have been as polite. I would have tried, but, you know. Right. Yes, um, we already we already brought this up, but I'll I'll show it again in case people haven't seen it. You know, because I was sent it today again. Um, you know, Riviera Pizza has a scam alert. Mm -hmm. Lisa, hundred and ten comments on a local pizzeria. <laughs> <laughs> this is. Boring. I I wonder what the comments say. I'm but everybody knows her. her. No, no, I'm That's sure you're not going to. But I am going to myself. Go take a look at that later on today. Riviera pizza and pasta. They actually got pretty good food, I heard. And cannolis. <laughs> no, nah, I heard everybody talking shit about that Hooks uh, fish and chicken. I would love to try that. Don't go there for mashed potatoes. Oh, shit. <laughs> Somebody oh, says she's live. Hold on now. We got to get confirmation. <laughs> yeah. Because if it's not, I'm, I'm blocking that account. <laughs> I'm blocking them because I'm watching. If she's live, let me know because I'm blocking that account. No. Oop, I'm getting them. Yeah, those imaginary mashed potatoes are fire. Somebody said they did get a notification that they were on XO, so I don't know. Nope, she's not on, but don't block them. Don't no. block them. I'm not blocking anyone. Okay, don't. No, no, I'm not. I'm not. I'm just being facetious. <laughs> um, I can't block anyone anyway. I, for some reason, I don't have the capability while I'm in the box. For some reason. Um, this is a conversation that someone else had. It looks like with Sophia. Oh, wow. let's hear it. Hello. Sorry to bother you, but please do not send Lisa any money. She is in active addiction. Her family has asked us to 
reach out to everyone and ask for nobody to send money. Find her sister at Total Mess Jess and the account scam slam 411. She explains in a video that there is not an emergency. Thank you. Okay, thank you. I don't care for the why or the way you all treat people. I tried to come into that live and listen, but I'm not interested in making fun of Lisa or laughing at her. We have we don't do that at all. Oh, this is from no. my thank you minders. Also, I don't believe in telling a stranger how and when to spend their money. I don't believe in this so-called tough love that is being preached. Wow. I show Lisa compassion and grace. What she does will always be her choice. I appreciate you for reaching out, but we will just have to agree to disagree. And they say, no one is making fun of her. We're trying to stop the money she's getting for rugs. We have said in proof that she's, we have solid proof that she is sending the money to her rug dealer. And she said, yes, people were. I was in there. The chat is horrible. Please leave me alone. I'm not interested in what you all are doing. I prefer to meet people where they're at. I can't, sorry, I can't read with the chat in the way. I have to wait till it moves. 